So I have two racks, I'm going to say, trays, racks of lipsticks here. Mostly MAC, OCC, some Rimmel, CoverGirl. These are the lipsticks that I don't think I want to get rid of. But then I have all of this <laughs> that I have to sort through. Um, I did empty one rack. Um, so we're going to see. My... I, ideally, I would like to have just lip glosses in here and everything that I would, you know, use. So then I would just have those three and then nothing else. So I'm going to get into this and separate it in between glosses, stains, and I don't know what else, lipsticks. These are the only lip liners I own. I don't own a lot because I don't know. So I'm going to keep my NYX long one. I love that color. I'm going to keep this Star Looks one and I'm also going to keep this Annabelle one. So I have a nude, a coral, and a pink. I'm also going to keep ooh, LA colors. This is like a reddish. So I'm going to keep that and then this burgundy one. So see how I have only one from, for each of the colors. See, I did well with lip liners. Then I have two of these NYX Jumbo Lip Pencils and I never use these. I used to use them for face charts. I don't know why I bought these. I don't like them. I have the pink swatched on my hand right there. I'm just not loving it. Nothing special about it. So I'm going to pass those ones on. So here are some lip balms and lip plumpers that I have. The only one I'm going to keep, I, I'm not going to keep any of them. I'm only going to hold on to these baby lips and then the Burt's Bees. Um, I'm not going to keep any of these. You know what? Maybe I'll keep the fat lips just to try, but this L'Oreal one is just, uh, I don't know. And then this Sally Hansen one, no. So I'm going to keep those. For someone who doesn't wear a lot of lip gloss, I sure do have a lot of lip gloss. So out of here, I know I'm going to keep this MAC one because I actually super love that color. And I like having a little frosty one, so I'm going to keep those two MAC ones. I love the Buxom doll, it's called Dolly Mix, so I have a full size and a mini, so I'm going to keep those. I hated this NYC one, I'm going to get rid of that. I really love the smell of this Principessa one. This brand used to be sold at Zeller's, but I don't know what happened to it now. Um, I love this Revlon one, and it's a dark color, so I'm going to hold on to that just for future. I've never even used this never even use this I've never even used this I've never even used this and I'm gonna um get rid of this Avon and Clinique one so I'm gonna hold on to these two because I have never used them <laughs> so I'm gonna get rid of three and then essentially hold on to six and then four more but I don't want to let go of any of these ones this one's pretty much one so there you go. <laughs> this is a tough part. Um, I don't know. I'm going to get rid of this Stila one. Oh my gosh, can wait. I have to show you the brush on this because you're going to flip out when you see this. You think everything's fun. It's like, okay, great, like a Stila lip enamel. Okay, awesome. What? Like, are you seeing this? Like, what? I tried this pop one once, but I know Alex, I think, really likes this, so I'm going to give that to her, specifically. Um, I love the Revlon Kissable Balm Stains. Like, I love them, especially in the summer. So I'm going to I'm gonna keep those ones. Um, and same with the CoverGirl one. I really enjoy that. I'm going to pass on this Revlon Just Bitten, whatever that is. I've only used it a couple times, and I just, it's just not for me. Same with this CoverGirl one. The, you know, these are like actually like the the liquid stain, and nah, I don't know. Um, and I'm going to get rid of this one. I'm just going to pass that one along because it's just not up my alley anymore. These I really don't use enough. I did really like them, but I do not use enough. I'm going to hold on to them for now and see what happens. Hold on to them, and if I don't use them within the week, I'm going to get rid of. So I'm going to save these and get rid of those ones, and I'm going to specifically give this one to Alex. So, yeah. Oh, my gosh, this thing's almost, well, it's halfway full. Um, and I didn't put these ones in there because I haven't even opened these or used them, and I'm giving that to Alex. So... I'm doing pretty good, I think. So now I have to go through these lipsticks. 
Um, the reason I have these ones in here is because I'm gonna hold on to the NYX one because it's black. I love the Revlon lip butters. This Makeup Forever one, Chanel, and then the rest are pretty much MAC and then CoverGirl and I love the real ones. So these ones I know I love and I would never dare get rid of, rid of any of those ones. So it's just these guys that I need to sort through. Okay, so these are the ones I have to sort through. Clinique Revlon Estee, La Estee Lauder? No, Lancome. Lancome, uh, NYX, Rimmel, Maybelline, NYX, CoverGirl, Maybelline, Revlon, Barbie. I have swatched them on my hands. Can any of you guys guess which lipsticks I'm going to save out of here? You might think I'm a little crazy because I'm not going to go for the one that you probably think. You probably think I'm going to save that one, right? I'm not. I am going to save that red which is this NYX one, just because I really love that color of it. And if I wanted like to not use one of my MAC lipsticks, like what? Um, I actually might go for that one. So I'm gonna hold on to the NYX one. I am also gonna hold on to this um, Maybelline Vivid, just because I love the color and I just love these lipsticks. Chloe talked me into that one. I'm also, going to keep this Maybelline Whisper just because it's so easy to apply and oh gosh and it is a really pretty lipstick where am I trying to grab here so I'm gonna save that one also um so these three thus far I was thinking of saving this Revlon one but it's just it's that one right there. Um, it's just, it's almost at the end. And the packaging, like look at the lid, it's so messy. Um, I, you know what, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna save it because I wore this thing the entire summer. Oh my gosh, I can't do this with one hand. Um, I really love that. And I think the rest of these are gonna go bye-bye because I just don't care. I bought this in the States and I haven't, even like I used it once, like. <laughs> It's just not for me. It smells like cherries or something. I thought it was something that it wasn't. You know what? I might keep this one actually because it's sort of like baby lips. Um, I don't know. But I'm going to say goodbye to those and hello to these guys. Oh my god, look. I have three, four, five spaces left. That means I get to buy five lipsticks. I'm just kidding. But I did pretty good, I think, right? That looks so ugly because it's all mishmash, but I think I did pretty well because now this is only all of the makeup that I have. Oh, see you later. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, I think I did a pretty awesome job at accomplishing what I wanted to accomplish today. So bravo to me. And now look at this enormous bag filled with all the makeup that I never use anymore and I do not need. Isn't that amazing? I'm so proud of myself. Now I'm gonna get all this makeup in the drawers. So now all my lipsticks are nicely placed up in one spot. Are you ready to see the final product? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Isn't that nice and clean? So now I have primers and concealers and foundations. Then in the next drawer I have powders, bronzers, and highlighters and blushes. And I think the next door is empty. Yeah, just an extra beauty blender and then some random crap that I depotted. Um, and then the next two drawers are empty also. And then on this side, in the top drawer, I just have like miscellaneous like tools and stuff that I always need when I'm doing makeup. And then below that, I have my brow products and eye primers, and I also found this little sample primer potion, so I just put it in there. Eyeliners, mascaras, and then cream eyeshadows. And then below that, I have all my palettes. I kept all my palettes, so I didn't go through that. And then I have loose eyeshadows, pigments, and then palettes. And then back here, I have lip pencils and those extra lip glosses that I had. And then the next drawer has hair products in the other two drawers. And then I just have my blushes to depot, and then that's it.